Hi, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to remove Jin Emotion on Ubuntu and its base distributions. This is a follow up from my previous video to install Jin Emotion on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. In the Linux world, we have multiple methods to add and remove software. For Debian based, we have traditional which handled by the advanced package tool, Snap, and Flatpak. Each packaging format has its own way to manage the packages. But, Genemotion has its own way on the other hand. It distributed with .bin via its official website. So you cannot uninstall it by typing sudo apt remove from the terminal. That's why you get unable to locate package message after running that command. But don't worry, because the developer of this cross-platform Android emulator builds the app with an uninstaller script. Okay, let's start by locating the installer. Right-click on empty space and choose open in terminal. Now run this format to remove the program from your system. The block text is the Ginemotion installation folder. You may need to change the path. It depends on how you installed it. If you installed it using sudo, then it should be on opt. Otherwise, it will on active directory. So, let's back to the terminal window. Press Y and enter when it asks you to remove temporary cache files in Ginemotion logs. The next thing what we gonna do, is open the home. Press Ctrl H to show the hidden files. Find a folder named .geniemobile, and simply delete it. You can also run sudo apt purge virtualbox to remove the virtualbox and its configuration if necessary. So, that's all I can share to uninstall Ginemotion on Ubuntu, Linux Mint, Pop OS, Elementary, and other Ubuntu based distributions. Thanks for watching, don't forget to share, subscribe, and click thumb up if you like this video.